Hey guys, I'm Boone. We're in New Jersey. Today is day 261 of my weight loss journey. Uh, this week, after some thought processes and um, stuff, I realized that last week's video, for some reason I thought it was August because it was on the 30th, but I fucked up. It's July, but now it's August. So today being, you know, August uh, 6th, um, I have been reflecting on my weight over the last month and I'm kind of having the epiphany that I'm not getting anywhere anytime soon. Um, I've hit my slump where I've been at my 350 to 353 back and forth bouncing around. Uh, it's been a little crazy and I'm not going to beat myself up over it but I realized that I plateaued. So with that said, um, I'm going to see if I can make some changes to my diet. Um, if you notice, I'm actually in a new space here. Uh, my girlfriend and I have moved in together and we just got our room semi set up. Uh, and the quality of my video isn't great because I'm shooting this on my laptop camera and it's a little screwy. But nevertheless, I'm going to push on and do this, you know, uh, vlog here. So this week has been a very odd week. I, and I also am not wearing a hat, which I just noticed. Um, it's been a very odd week. I've been trying to get set up to do the wheelchair vans at work. This will give me more exercise and also a little bit more money. Um, I'm basically, it's going to give me a 10% raise, which is good. I kind of need the money right now to uh, take care of some stuff uh, with, you know, my pending divorce stuff and moving forward. That's just one of the things I really, really need to get taken care of. Um, so I've been working towards getting in the wheelchair van this week. I've been kind of looking forward to it just to get that raise. Uh, but, you know, it is what it is. Um, right now I'm, per I'm currently waiting on uh, getting certified for the full CPR course. Um, I have my uh, MAV or MAVO um, certification already. I've had that since April. But they've been trying to get me in a van, and I just kind of have been hesitant. You know, after the surgery, I'm still experiencing some things that are a little hard to talk about. But I'm going to talk about one that's really plagued me because it's been eight months, and I still haven't had a change in it. And it's kind of affected me in the last couple weeks. Um, I went out to train with one of my drivers, and we were talking about, you know, how we, you know, I had to, I had to pee. And he was like, well, you know, I could just pull over somewhere. And, and I was like, yeah, no, no, I can't. You know, I got a bathroom, whatever, you know. And he kind of looked at me like I was a little weird. And then uh, my girlfriend said something to me the other day about, you know, oh, guys can just whip it out and go. And uh, when I woke up from the surgery, I didn't expect this. I tried to go to the bathroom and... I couldn't go standing up and the girl told me that you know they cut through some of my muscles and stuff and then I would have to reheal and I would have to sit down to go and I've been doing that for eight months and I don't know if well it's gotten a little bit better like if I really really have to go I can stand up and go you know uh, that's how I've been doing it when I take my drug tests for my you know pain doctors um i have to stand up and go so i'll just not take my morning pee and wait until like 11 30 to go pee at the doctor's office and by then i really really have to go so i can go um but other than that i've been having a lot of trouble with it and it, it kind of bugs me a little bit um if you guys any of you have had surgery and you guys have this kind of thing let me know. Let me know I'm not alone. You know, um, it's it's something that I don't know if it's specific to me. But I feel at this point, eight months, I should have that 
muscle mass built back up. You know, I feel a lot better than I did when I first started this. I have a lot more strength, a lot more core strength, but the strength not for my bladder to work unless I'm under, it's underweight, which is really odd. Um, so yeah, that's one of the things that I wanted to talk about this week that was really just kind of bothering me. I haven't really talked about it and I needed to talk about it. Um, other than that, you know, things are going great in my life. I've spent the last week with my girlfriend and we're, you know, moving in together pretty soon. You know, uh, right now we're just getting things set up. I'm going to be moving some things from my place over to here and big changes and, you know, big future and, uh, hopefully not so big future if you catch my drift. Um, with any luck, I'm going to try to, you know, keep watching what I'm eating a little bit more this week, a little bit more closely. I noticed with the heat and everything, I've been drinking a lot more and, um, you know, I've been drinking, I've kind of gotten off a lot of the zero calorie stuff and more on the low calorie stuff. Uh, but, you know, nevertheless, I'm still eating a little fast food. I'm still eating a lot of snack food and some other food that's probably not really great to eat in the first place. Uh, so with that said, that's about all I got this week. I want to thank you guys again for liking, commenting, and subscribing, and for watching. And I will see you guys in the next video. Let's be our best selves together.